really work like a, 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 to work like sp strings uh, attached to this uh, you might want to use a cloth uh, simulation on this and uh, the way you do that is it uh, let me first remove uh, this how is it called I need to remove the bevel so that we don't have any thickness to it and then convert this into a mesh so control and then just go to object and then convert uh, to mesh to curve object I can even right click and then convert this to a mesh uh, we need a few more loops in some areas so I'm just going to do that select that select that and that subdivide this a few times uh, like that now if we add as uh, a cloth simulation you can see this it just holds off uh, but uh, if you select these points here and give them a hook nothing will happen but uh, if we go to uh, the vertex groups and add a new vertex group and uh, make sure that uh, we assign let's first make sure that nothing else okay yeah assign only those parts those vertices and uh, go to the cloth simulation and pin and a shape pin uh, those vertices you see what we get then also uh, we also want to have these pinned as well Control H and uh, we can also add them uh, to this vertex group I see what we have and, uh, don't forget the vertices on this side assigned to that group and I uh, have that so if I select this and parent it to this here I will get something like that so when we play back I will get something like that the cloth is working but uh, the problem is uh, the hooks are just stretching only this part here so to make sure that uh, the entire uh, the entire object is stretched or the entire string is stretched I uh, want to go to the modifiers and make sure that the cloth modifier is below all the hooks we have in our uh, modifier stack so uh, this is the cloth make sure it's down now you can see that uh, we get something like that and then now the problem is with this middle hook here uh, where do we want to attach something like that if you want to have some thickness to this all you have to do is add uh, a skin modifier and uh, you can see the skin is only added to uh, the top a uh, string uh, if you want it to be on the second string as well just have select any vertex and make sure you give it a root uh, mark it as a root as well so let me reduce this by using Control a scale this down now you can see we have the string working but except this area here so I think this would have to be would have to be removed uh, from the pinning group remove uh, to just work with that but the problem is if you look at uh, my uh, this is a separate string uh, so what I'm going to do is just instead of having it as a separate string I'm just going to merge it uh, with this so I can select these vert vertices around here and merge them at the center and uh, that should do the trick something like that uh, if you want uh, this to collide with the other objects you can just give these uh, collision uh, modifiers and uh, things like that uh, but uh, yeah that's how you can set up uh, this